don't you all come up, come up here? And, um, good afternoon. My name is Brian Rothenberg with Progress Ohio. Um, I am pleased to be here today, uh, thanks to Senator Charlita Tavares, who has long been a champion of uh, helping make our country what it always has been friendly to Im immigrants and new people and new citizens here. Um, we are today announcing um, across the nation the Alliance for Citizenship, which is a new national campaign to win citizenship for 11 million aspiring citizens who are living in the United States of America. Um, we are also here to talk about, as Senator Tavares will discuss, what we can do at the state level as well to help some of the many new citizens and many families some of them were born here, uh, continue to contribute in our society and live in our society in the same way that most of us in America have gotten here. And that is through hard work, through love of America, and through a dedication to the state of Ohio. The American people overwhelmingly in polling support citizenship as opposed to uh, legalization without a chance to earn citizenship, but this new road to citizenship at the federal level must include the following things. A direct channel without contingencies such as putting in place unrelated enforcement triggers before an immigrant can obtain a green card or citizenship. It needs to be direct. There should be, for the 11 million undocumented immigrants who are here and working hard and strengthening our country, a chance, a path to earn permanent residency and citizenship for the country they love and the country that they pay taxes to. This should take place within a reasonable time frame. Immigrants rooted in this country should not have to wait decades to obtain citizenship. And we need fair immigration reform and smarter enforcement, including an end to troubling laws and policies that have eroded our individual rights and made our communities less secure and our job and workforce less secure. We need to not increase heavy-handed immigration enforcement in this country. I don't know if people are aware of it, but we spend more money on immigration enforcement at the borders in this country than we do on any federal law enforcement, CIA, FBI, Bureau of Alcohol, Tobacco, and Firearms. We spend more money in that way. This is part of a bipartisan agreement. We agree with Chairman Leahy the Senate and President Obama and even the former Republican Secretary of Commerce, Carlos Gutierrez, that Congress needs to move quickly and we need to get this done, get it done this year. Congress has the best chance in years to enact fair, accountable immigration reform in 2013. We ask that this immigration law be passed and I am now going to invite uh, Senator Barnes and Representative Ramos and then some of the other folks from our communities in Ohio to speak about this, but there are things we can do in Ohio as well to welcome these citizens into citizenship in Ohio. 